<laughs> this stuff looks nice. Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel. So, I am doing uh, my master's in radiation biology at Oxford University. And there are things that have been, they haven't been confusing me, but they shocked me, seriously. So, I'm going to tell you the whole story. And I don't know how this will sound in your ears, but I hope that <laughs> it doesn't confuse you too. <laughs> Anyways, let me tell you how everything started and how I got confused and now my brain is trying to get on the line or on track. So I watched cartoon for the first time when I was 16. Yeah, I had visited my auntie who lived in the town. So there is an image that um, there's an image that entered my brain and that's the image I've been with since I watched cartoon when I was 16. To me, this is a cartoon. At my high school, I did biology chemistry and mathematics. The, the most important thing there is biology. And my teachers called this a diagram. After completing all the lower levels of education, a good higher level of education, that's university. I went to Japan and I did my, bachel my bachelor's degree in biological sciences. And my teachers, all my teachers, respectively of the faculty, because I also took classes from social sciences, they called this a diagram. And this matched with my brain so well, because I knew that it's a diagram. Where do things go wrong? I mean, I don't know if things went wrong, but something happened. So, after my undergraduate degree, I came to Oxford University and doing radiation biology. So, of course, we get to um get to see diagrams that we have to interpret you know during the orientation things were fine i wasn't confused by anybody because things were fine and they sounded okay to me and they sounded <laughs> okay <laughs> to, to me i mean okay to me in the first class the professor started teaching and then the diagram popped up and he was like, if you look at this cartoon, and I'm like, oh, I got, so, <laughs> I got so shocked. The professor had an American accent, so I was like, hmm, maybe in America, diagrams are called cartoons. So I didn't care so much about it. So on the second day, another professor came and he was like if you look clearly on this cartoon i was like huh <laughs> i was like why am i calling it a cartoon <laughs> so on the third day another professor came with the same thing and she was a lady <laughs> if you clearly look at this cartoon i was like oh my god you call it a cartoon for the past 24 years this has been a diagram and none of my teachers have called this a cartoon only here in oxford university professors call this a cartoon i believe there are so many students in africa maybe who have <laughs> an image of a cartoon which is similar to that of mine so if i go back to teach them about maybe cancer or anything in biology how will i have the confidence to tell them that this is a cartoon I have a feeling that that's where the problem will arise because I, I believe they will know cartoon as this and they will know this as a diagram. If I'm the examiner and I get a student who writes, if you look at this cartoon, I will just laugh so much. You understand that? I will laugh seriously. <laughs> seriously. So I also imagine myself writing for the examiner. The cartoon above describes this and this. Oh, this cartoon depicts, this cartoon illustrates, oh my god. <laughs> this... <laughs> anyway, that is it guys. Don't forget to like, share and smash that red button. I will see you soon.
Bye bye. Love ya.